back in week three of the off-season program. Uh, all season goes by way too fast. I love my traveling. Uh, got to go do Australia, New Zealand, and do all this other fun stuff. And uh, it's back at the grind now, though. So it's been a lot of fun. Back in my house, getting moved back in. So I got to hook up the PlayStation, of course. All season, I love to travel. I love to do different things and see the world and just enjoy my free time and let my body recover. Guys, I'm dominating this team. It's 11 to 1. But when we start back, it's time to go. And that's what everything else is on the side now. Now it's number one is football. That's what we're looking forward to. We're looking forward to a good season. I've liked the workouts a lot this year. You have one strength coach that works with the tight ends and running backs only. You have a strength coach that works with the offensive line. You have a strength coach that works with receivers, a strength coach that works with their QBs. So you're not doing the same thing other guys are doing. You're doing what is needed for your position to succeed, which I think is a huge thing for us. They'll make sure guys aren't overworked or they don't kill themselves too much and they monitor that kind of stuff. And that would be huge for the whole team. But it also, I have, I have obviously don't have a lot of mileage on my legs because I didn't get a chance for the first few years of my career. So now that I've got it, I still feel good, no issues. So I'm ready to go. To me, my body and stuff, I feel like I'm 24. You're only old as you allow yourself to be. Well, I've shown that you can do it at 30. It, it's not, it's all in your mind. It's all how you work. Everybody's excited, they want to get things turned around right now. They don't want to do it tomorrow, they don't want to do it next week, they want to do it right now. We're all buying into it and we want to change things now. We don't want to do it later and we want to show that to everybody. Nobody's going to have expectations for us, which is fine. We'll feed off of it, we like it, and we'll just keep going. I'm feeling good. I wouldn't have signed back if I wasn't. I wanted to be here when we turn this thing around. And I believe we're going to do it, and I want to be part of the reason why we do. So that was a huge reason why I did it. And then obviously the fans here are amazing. I think as long as they're behind us, we, there's no reason why we can't. We relish the fact that we get to play tougher teams. Every year in the NFL is different. You never know who's going to be good, who's going to be bad. You're, all, you're going to have a few teams that are always going to be good, but then you're going to have teams that come out of nowhere. Why can't it be us? Like that's, that's, that's the motto you've got to have at all times, because you never know what's going to happen.